Hi, Matthew with F Class Community Channel. This today will be a slightly different video, but thank you for joining me. It will be an unboxing video of a new item we got for F Class. And I've waited several months for this. And first off, I'd like to thank uh, Bighorn Sales, Gary Eakins uh, out of Houston, for bringing this in. It's been a long time. I just wanted to give you a shout out because he's been. Uh, Gary's been a very good guy to deal with and he's he's kind of worked through the steps with me in terms of bringing this in uh, uh, bring this in so uh, what I'm gonna do is right now I'm just gonna unbox uh, the item here and show you guys what is what's new for the F class community channel This is this right here is a new McMillan stock. Wait, what type of stock you, you think? Well, I shoot FTR, so uh, the most popular stock out there right now, I believe, for FTR is this little, little baby I have here. This is a new. Macmillan XIT stock and that's what's in the package what I'll be doing is uh, over the next few months do, do a review on, on the stock and I'm changing up the system this is inleted right now for my Panda action the channel the channel groove is a one and a quarter inch diameter all straight through inleted for a, a panda action there so right now in hand it's really solid I've what I did get is the edge fill which is a lighter fill the Anschutz rail on the front end on forehand there the adjustable thumb wheel cheek piece and uh, this is the, in terms of the, uh, I'll bring in a little bit closer there. This is the edge fill with the uh, ambush, carbon ambush finish. So you can see the carbon fiber weave. And what they've done is they've molded in, molded in there. Hopefully you can see that guys molded in there the pattern looks good I didn't get a butt stock because I'm putting my my own plate system on the back uh, hopefully and then what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna grab grab a scale and weigh this stock uh, if right now currently my extreme gun shooting center stock is about four 0.58 pounds and with the uh, just the stock alone uh, with the heavy varmint barrel that I recently installed on it it is uh, just under 18 pounds so it's, it's just bordering on on being overweight um, the Anschutz rail is attached via there are escutcheons or, or bolts on the bottom it's hollowed out on the uh, uh, fore end there. There's a texture to the front of the stock and the escutcheons, there are escutcheons on the uh, bottom uh, front two action uh, action screws. So this is a nice stock. Thank you Gary for bringing this in. Again, I look up his Facebook and his Instagram uh, page. I'd like, just like to thank him for bringing this in. The, uh, the other thing that this has is the pillars that are the pillars are, are installed uh, with the edge fill. So right now this this stock feels actually quite light. What else did I get from Gary is the trigger guard and hopefully the, and I think the screws are the action screws are, are in there as well. And Gary sent uh, cloth. 
this is a nice cloth, a microfiber cloth. So thank you, Gary. Right now, what I'm going to do is transition. I'm just going to weigh this stock and tell you how much this stock weighs. Hopefully, it comes in a little bit less than four and a half pounds, uh, even four pounds, uh, because my butt stock system is approximately at 450 grams, which is almost a, uh, a pound. So let's uh, let's do that. Hey guys, here's the scale, and I'm just going to put it on and see how much it's going to weigh, and maybe see how much weight I have to take out of my action and other things. So right now, as, as it sits, uh, with the edge fill, uh, the XIT graphite molded in Macmillan carbon ambush stock weighs in without the butt stock at 3.65 pounds. Awesome. I've got some room to play with in terms of weight. It is awesome that it, it came in this light. You're seeing the, the weight as it is the same time as, as I am. That was one, one of my biggest concern is, is weight and how it fits in with, with, uh, with the Panda. Now the question is, will I bed this stock? Uh, the answer is probably no. From the things I've read at this time, what I'm not, I'm, I won't be betting this stock. I, uh, what I, I will be doing is test, testing it without betting. And then if there are inconsistencies with it, then what I'll do at the most is epoxy the recoil lug in place, just so that there's no movement in the action within the stock. So what uh, the next video is, well, I'll put this together and uh, see how it uh, all fits in. So this is Matthew with F-Class Community Channel, showing you the new F-Class Community cha Channel, which is my new rifle, Macmillan, XIT stock or exit stock. So remember to keep an eye on the flags and tight groups.